Bronx, New York City in shock and mourning after a five alarm fire erupts in a Bronx apartment, killing at least 19 people. Officials say children were among the victims. Nearly 200 firefighters responded to the call and this morning we're learning a malfunctioning space heater was to blame. CBS 4's Tom Hansen reports from the scene of the fire in the Bronx. The fire that swept through a Bronx apartment building Sunday is one of New York City's deadliest in more than three decades. I never expected 2022 to come in this way. The blaze took the lives of adults and children and injured dozens, including several who were hospitalized in critical condition. My entire department mourns along with the families here today. Uh, and our entire city. Uh, we're all about saving lives, and the loss of one life is sad for us. City officials say firefighters found victims on every floor of this 19 story building and were rescuing some who were in cardiac and respiratory arrest. Black smoke, I can barely see from me to you. About 200 firefighters responded after the fire broke out around 11 a.m. Sunday. This resident says people fled their apartments and took temporary shelter in hers. Once the fire department got there and they was able to get us out. They said, follow the stairs until you see light. Officials said the fire originated in a duplex apartment on the second and third floors caused by a malfunctioning electric space heater. The fire consumed that apartment that is on two floors and part of the hallway. The commissioner said firefighters found the door to the apartment open, which allowed smoke to spread through the 120 unit building. Tom Hanson, CBS News, New York.